this experiment is to study the technique of isolation of frog's heart and assembly setup. Objectives of the drugs can be tested on isolated preparations of experimental animals. Example, frog's heart. Even though the frog's heart differ from a mammalian heart, the fundamental properties of the cardiac muscle are common to both the hearts. Frog's heart being studied than the mammalian for experimentation. Frog's heart has three chambers, two atria and one ventricle. Frog sinus works as pacemaker. Impulses from sinus spread over on both atria and ventricle. Starling's heart liver as recording device, one can easily record normal activity of frog's heart and also effect of drugs under study. Drugs may increase or decrease heart rate and force of contraction. Such increase in heart rate and force of contraction by drugs is called positive chronotropic and positive inotropic responses respectively. Whereas decrease in both rate and force of contraction of heart by a drug is called as negative chronotropic and negative inotropic response respectively. Drugs which show positive chronotropic and inotropic responses may be used clinically in bradycardia. Whereas drugs which show negative chronotropic and inotropic responses may be used clinically in tachycardia. Drugs on frog's heart, it is necessary to isolate and perfuse frog heart preparation with frog bringer solution. Always select a healthy frog of either sex. Now, pith the frog with the help of a pithing needle. To pith, identify the pithing spot which is on dorsal central surface of the skull. Feel a cavity and then insert and rotate pithing needle by around 45 degrees to and fro. This leads to breaking of connection between brain and spinal cord. Such a frog is used for experimental purpose as there is no sensation in it. Now, pin the limbs of the frog to dissecting tray. Remove the abdominal skin with a sharp scissor. Expose the abdominal muscle. Cut on each side of the abdominal muscle up to pectoral girdle. With the help of finger, separate the blood vessel to avoid loss of blood and expose heart. You can observe rhythmic heart beats. Now remove the pericardium, that is a thin outer membrane without damaging the heart. Lift the heart by using fingers and tear off the thin membrane that covers the sinus venosus and its branches. Observe three branches of sinus venosus. Now pass a thread beneath the sinus venosus with the help of a curved needle. Now take a small V-shaped cut on the middle branch of sinus venosus. Allow the heart to get drain completely of the blood. Wash the sinus portion with frog finger solution frequently if necessary. This will avoid blood clotting and occlusion at the tip of the cannula. Insert the tip of the cannula into sinus venosus and tie the thread at the gray just to ensure that the cannula is at proper place. 
give a small cut in one of the branches of outer or the perfuse it to come out then isolate the perfused frog's heart from its body by cutting the adjacent tissues take care to avoid any damage to the heart fix the isolated and perfused heart on a stand for experiment and is mounted at specific height on a round clamp attached to a stand perfusion water is connected to side branch of sims venus cannula glass containers that have no air tubes require air inlet an adjustable clamp of roller type controls the pressure on the perfusion tube to regulate the flow of frog ringer solution conventionally iv bottle and iv set are used for the same purpose sims venus cannula is made up of glass and consist of tip to insert into sinus venosus pre for holding heart preparation side branch to connect perfusion bottle sterling's heart lever is used to record the contractions of heart with the help of the tip of this lever recording is done on smoked paper fixed on circular cylinder it is made up of stainless steel or light aluminium prelim of this lever is connected to isolated heart with the help of thread one sherington's rotating drum it is also known as kinograph it consists of circular drum speed regulating gear shaft to which drum is connected and main on or off switch it has clutch lever screw lift to alter the position of drum and electrical striker kinograph paper is wrapped on circular drum and is smoked with black smoke of kerosene or benzene for laboratory experimentation should be carried out scientifically and holistically selection of proper cannula for cannulation selection of proper recording device operational features of kinograph